Well, for more on this, we can speak to uh, France 24's Cyril Payen. Uh, Cyril, uh, Mali's government then has been clear they want France out of the country. Is uh, the UN uh, the next step ultimately in this? Well, well, very much so. It looks very much that there is a parallel between the the way of action from the uh, the, the transitional government in Mali towards France, against France, uh, for the past years, uh, and what is actually happening now very fast now in the crisis, in this huge war of words between the United Nations and um, and, and Mali. Uh, MINUSMA is a very huge uh, organization uh, which counts 14 thousand soldiers uh, um, uh, on the on the ground less than 200 have been killed this is the very heavy toll so this crisis uh, comes at, at a very critical uh, time it looks very much that the the Malian uh, junta is trying to expel everybody who can be on his roads and uh, there is in the MINUSMA um, a unit which is uh, devoted to investigate on human rights violations so this is maybe the, the, the beginning of the problem and it looks very much again as the what happened with the French crisis so when in January, last January, the French ambassador was expelled also in the same extremely violent way from the from uh, Mali, the same uh, modus operandi. Now this is the spokesperson, which is people, uh, uh, people, uh, a man, sorry, that everybody knows very well. For the past nine years in Mali, he organized many press conferences, was the, really the face of the United Nations there. So what, what comes next, we don't know, but it's a very risky situation. And now only the Russians uh, tends to be uh, very much uh, 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 welcome in uh, Mali today. Okay, so that shift uh, continuing uh, in Mali for the time being. Cyril Payen, thank you very much for keeping us up to date.